Everybody would need a handicapping thoroughbred racing from the Big A Aqueduct Race Course Ozone Park, New York on Saturday, January the 23rd. This is my day at the track.com. Naira, New York Racing Association race of the day. So take a look at the race three feature this afternoon, folks. 1.20 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Busanda Stakes. 8.3 furlongs. That's a mile and 70 yards. An Aqueduct's unique winterized inner dirt track. Three-year-old fillies race for $100,000. Tenders number one, Floradora, number four, Scatouche, number five, Alto Bell, and number two, Dreams to Reality. A few folks who enjoy a little thoroughbred racing history and company your handicapping efforts this afternoon. The Busanda is named for Ogden Phipps Philly, who not only beat the Colts in the suburban handicap of 1951, but also bested males twice in the Saratoga Cup. She posted ten victories from ages two to five against females. She won races like the Alabama, the Top Flight, the Newcastle, and the Diana Stakes. Perhaps Basanda's greatest renown was as a broodmare. She was the dam of Buck Passer, two-year-old champion in 1965 and Horse of the Year in 1966. Here in the 43rd running of the stakes test, number one, Flora Dora takes a class drop of three track master units as the overall speed leader in this field, racing at her about a mile 70 yards on the dirt, has produced power runs in each of her last three, hitting the board in the pair, including the power run wing to break her maiden, facing better company in her third race back. Number four, Scatooch has hit the board in power run fashion in four straight, including a maiden breaking power run win in her last start. Morning line favorite is number 5 Alto Bell, who comes off a blistering 19 length power run win to break her respective maiden in her last start. She is taking, however, a step up in class 6 units this afternoon. Race 3 summary number 1, Floradora, tops my contenders list this afternoon here at Aqueduct, which also includes number 4 Spatouche, number 5 Alto Bell, and number 2 Dreams to Reality. One four five two in the third from Aqueduct, the hundred thousand dollar boost on the stakes. Bonus long shots. Let's go to Charlestown, race seven. Speed honors in this optional claiming field tonight, sprinting at four and a half furlongs on the dirt, shared by a pair of shots. Number four, just for real, is four to one in the six to one shot. Number six, Dag Burnt. Mahoning Valley Race Course, race six, the twelfth to one bomb, number four, Summer's Law. The overall speed leader in this climbing field spraying at six furlongs on the dirt. So from Aqueduct on a Saturday, waiting for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.